The background is when each page printed with your laser printer appears to have a gray haze or film of toner on them instead of white. The problem could have various causes. The backgrounding is most likely due to a bad toner cartridge. The toner may be damp or too old. Install another toner cartridge. During the printing process the best toner particles are used first. So, at the end of the life of the cartridge, only low quality toner particles remain, and that may cause backgrounding. Look at the drum surface. It should look shiny, with no toner on it. If your printer uses no all-in-one toner cartridge, remove the old toner from the toner cassette, and install a new toner cartridge. Try printing 20 pages. See if the issue begins to clear up. Change paper. It may be damp. Make sure that the paper type setting is set to plain paper. If you are printing on any media other than plain copy paper, please try printing 10 to 20 pages on plain paper. Certain specialty papers, like pre-printed paper, heavier weight paper, and labels, are more difficult for toner to adhere to correctly. The transfer roller is a black, spongy roller that sits below the toner cartridge. It tends to turn white-gray when it's contaminated by paper dust. A dirty transfer roller is more likely to cause light print than background, but it's certainly worth checking both the roller and its housing. The contacts on a transfer roller are sometimes nothing more than conductive plastic. The roller itself is a conductive rubber. Clean the transfer roller. In the description of this video, you'll find a link to a video on this argument. Inside the cartridge, there is the charge roller. You can find it near the drum. Clean the charge roller with water. Remember that not all toner cartridge have a charge roller. In the description of this video, you'll find a link to a video on this argument. If present, check if the print setting is too high. Color printers often have no settings. They have a color density sensor on the printer, essentially, a camera pointing at the transfer belt. During its calibration procedure, the printer reads part of the image placed on the belt, then makes appropriate adjustments. Note that very dry conditions, like in winter, change the static field, and this can increase the background shading. It could be a problem of contact cleanliness. Check the USB cable. On the side of the cartridge, there are electrical contacts, bits of tin plate, and axle metal ends, that push on metal plates, inside the printer. Unplug the printer, and clean the contacts, with alcohol. Wiping with a finger will also work, but if your hands are sweaty, you have contaminated the contact with corrosive salt mixture, so it will tarnish more quickly. Gently bend the plates to ensure better contact. If a contact does look tarnished, scratch it with a screwdriver. The fault may be with the high voltage power supply unit. It is not easy to test in high voltage power supply unit. The maximum input for electronic meters tends to 600 volts. Several voltages used by laser printers are over that point. 
Most recent printers work under 3000 volts, but they may generate more, and it could be voltage limiting circuits that have failed. High voltage power supply units are expensive and quite difficult to change. If none of the suggestions help to correct the issue, probably you have to bring your printer to a repair center. <laughs>